you can now have full visibility of the multiple levels of your bill of materials. This will definitely save you time and increase transparency over your production process. Click in Production, Bill of Materials and View Bill of Materials. Here you can see all of your bill of materials, also known as BOM. To make your life easier, you can select what BOM or product you want to use as a filter for your search. For this example, I will be selecting BOM number 6. This is the bill of material for my wooden crates. They will later be used as packaging for some of our best beers. If you want, you can have full visibility on what other bill of materials have this crate as a component. Simply tick the display associated top level bomb box. All the bill of materials containing the wooden crate are now displayed and I can also see how many sub-bombs are included in each of those bill of materials by looking at the sub-bomb count column. Now let's click on my mix crate bill of materials. You can rearrange the orders the items appear in your bomb by sorting by product code or simply clicking on the drag icon and dragging and dropping to a better suitable position. Click on the product code to open the product record or if you want to have a peek on what's on that particular bomb, click on the arrow to have all lines displayed. You can also click on the pop-out icon to have you directed to this bomb. Back to our example. You can click on the expand button as well. This will expand all the bill of materials used on this bomb, giving you full visibility of all the layers involved. Please remember, that you can only adjust the quantities and wastage for the components of this bill of material. Click on the print arrow and choose from the drop down menu if you want to have only this bill of material printed or if you want the whole tree. For this example, let's have a look on how the whole tree will look like. A PDF ready to be sent to the printer will be available, displaying the breakdown of each bomb. Thanks for watching.